What's up, TJ Gang? It's your boy Jimmy. And your girl Tink. And your boy Cairo. Say hi, Cairo. So tonight we're gonna be basically giving you guys our first night home alone with the baby. We've been in the hospital with him for what about like two days? Yeah, like two days, and then we was here with your mom, but and then my mom was here, but which she just left last night around five in the morning. So right now we're feeding him, and then after this, I don't know, I guess. We'll just come back when he's done or almost done and we'll just go from there. Say hi. Um, you gotta focus on it. So it's about 30 minutes after we fed him and we've been trying to get him to go to sleep. He was laying on my chest at first, but he has this thing where like he wakes up literally like 10 minutes after he goes to sleep. I don't know why, and he just starts crying. We're not sure exactly what he's crying for because of course he can't speak, but we're slowly just trying to figure it out by doing little things. The shush, look at him. It worked, but I figured, as I said, it worked. It's about to stop working. And he's, uh -oh. See, he, it's like he be tired, but he don't want to go to sleep. Like, yeah, I don't know he what he think he's gonna miss. Off and then wait back yeah, up. or like if Jimmy's holding him, or if I'm holding him, and he's sleep, and you go to lay him down, and he's like, no, like he, I think he just wants to be held. Nah, I don't think he want to be held. We don't know what it is because even when we're holding him, he still cries. So I'm not sure why. Do you want to wash dishes, or do you want me to wash? Do I want to wash dishes, guys? Well, it's not a lot of dishes. It's more like. Like his bottles and his stuff. Do you want to wash them now or you want to wash them later? I guess if I'm being a good dad, I guess I should be the one to wash them. Can you show them how much I pump today? Well, the one oh, yeah. So pump. Tink has been pumping. So if you guys don't know, the way their breasts work is... But you don't even know. I got to tell them. I got to tell them what I think I know. But the way their breasts work is basically when she first starts to pump, when he comes out, they have something called colostrum that comes out. It's not really milk, but I guess it is milk. Correct. He Lost talked him. about the collage that I can't even explain, so I don't even know how he's well, gonna be able to explain. You, and if you guys are wondering all those clothes over there, my mom was here and she yeah. was folding up all our clothes. So she, those are just clothes we gotta put away. His mom folded up all the clothes. She cleaned all the bathrooms. She cleaned all the rooms. She cleaned the kitchen. She did everything. Like when I say like everything that we would never got to. Like speaking of us never getting to it, it's a lot especially yeah. with him. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to find a maid. I'm looking for one. So if you guys want to come over and maybe clean up for oh, like the cheap skin. So before I had him, I was like 136 pounds. Wait, no. Before I before I was pregnant, I was 98. Before I had him, I was 136. So today I got on the scale and I am 120.1. And guys, before she was pregnant, she was not even 100 pounds. Yeah, I never touched 100 so pounds. let's it's take so a crazy. guess in the comments, guys. Do you guys think she's going to be back underneath 100 pounds? Me, personally, I think with you pumping milk and stuff, I don't think so. But what okay, do you think? How, well, how long do you think it's going to take me to get there? Like, get to what? I just said I don't think you get okay. there. Okay, wait, where do you think I'm gonna be at? I think and you're gonna when? be around my weight. She's 120, which is what I am. But when? By when though? Well, I mean, you're almost there. And much. I still have a stomach, so. Okay, maybe 110, 115. I don't think you're gonna be under 100 pounds. So I'm be 110 by when? Are you by, missing the question by I when? missing the question just a little. But by maybe. Maybe I, since you lost so much weight that quick, I'll say probably in two days you'll be probably back at 110. Yeah, okay, I'm just gonna let him show you out of milk because he's talking crazy. Pounds already. Here's what that was pump. from what? Is it leaking? Don't don't let it leak no, now. But this is about five and a half. What is it? Ounces? Yeah, five and a half ounces, and that was just from one session. One session. I'm telling you guys, literally, he will be asleep when we're holding him, and then the minute we put him down, he wakes up. I have no idea. So yeah, I'm basically about to go ahead and clean these up and get them washed up. And once you just telling me about this thing over here, what do I use this for? It's supposed to be a sterilizer. This thing right here, I don't know how to use it, but it does sterilize it. Yes. So you're gonna take this part off, and right there, it's like water gonna go in there. You take this part off, and are you paying attention? You paying attention? Mm, kinda. And then in there, it's kinda open. You would do it. Oh. Okay, well, you wash them and I'll put them in there for you then. Okay. Alright, alright, 
All right. <gasps> what happened? You were supposed to be asleep. I was showing them that I had the magic touch. It's not. There's no magic touch. Okay. It's okay. Yeah, yep. Nope. nope. <laughs> All right. All right, buddy. All right. Think he cooler than me or something? I got the magic touch. <laughs> okay, whatever. So I'm going to make him a bottle, and then I'm going to sterilize his stuff because he need a bottle first. Um, We're going to do one and a half. Just because earlier he had like one and a half ounces of formula as well, but he stopped eating it and now obviously he's hungry, so I'm like, well, it doesn't make sense to give him the whole two ounces or whatever. Okay, bro. You okay? I'm cooling. Where my bottle at, bro? He don't want this. It's the, he don't want what? He don't give want him, the give him your nipple. Imagine! Oh, yeah, might, I'm sorry! Quiet, this made him quiet. Watch this. Because he think that's the position <laughs> to get a nipple food. Check them. Finished your whole bottle? If anybody in the comments owns a baby, Oh, Please tell me. Jimmy. You why Jimmy. does he eat every hour? This almost. is how Jimmy burps him weirdly. This is a good no. This is not weird. The doctor told me I could do this. There's two ways. Mm -hmm. Three ways. Mm -hmm. You could do it this way where yes. you put your hand right there and then mm -hmm. you pat his back, lean him over forward. Mm -hmm. You could do it this way. That's the way I do. Cairo. Cairo. I don't know where his head is. Jack Jack. Some of some Jack Jack. <laughs> Jack Jack. He know you hear me talking to him. Here's the current time, you guys can see that. He just woke up, so I'm right here to go ahead and make him a bottle, which I already did. But before I give it to him, I gotta go ahead and warm it up a little bit. Harold was crying, like, crying, crying, crying his soul out. And Jimmy just sitting over there on the game, right? <laughs> Kyro, I'm coming. I'm just finishing up the game. Like, he's just gonna understand it. Like, okay, Dad, just finish playing it. I'll just be right here waiting. I had a high kill game. I had 13 kills in Apex. If he don't you play care. Apex, about, okay, but he don't care about Apex, that. If you play Apex, you know how hard it is to Jimmy, get 13 kills. Jimmy, it's a game. Kills. It's a game. It's a game. I know, but at the end of the day, I always come to my son's rescue. <laughs> so, yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't know if you guys can see that or not, but it's 3.47 a.m. And he just woke up not too long ago. He was up a little earlier, but we didn't record that because he literally went right back to sleep. We didn't even have to pick him up. We just put his pacifier in his mouth. So as of right now, this is what's going on. He over here put, I'm always say shh, 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 shh. And he go take his head and just slowly put it over my mouth <laughs> like you should. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Mm. As you guys can see, he is in his little phase where he wants to go to sleep, but he doesn't want to go to sleep. We're pretty much getting used to that. But yeah, we figured we'll close it out here because all that's going to happen is around 5 if he doesn't go to sleep right now. Around 5, he's going to eat again. And yeah, that's pretty much it. He's going to go back to sleep. So yeah, this is going to be the close out of this video. You guys go ahead and let us know if you guys want to see any more content like this. You got anything you want to say, baby? I'm going to go to sleep. And with that being said, we love y'all and we'll see y'all later. Peace.